what's up everybody so let's talk about keith lee once again so y'all know he was invited to the BET awards on sunday he and his wife attended the awards and while at the awards taraji p henson got keith lee and jordan howlett mixed up also at the award keith lee was given a rose and later on that night after the award keith lee made a video of him throwing the rose on the ground. And even though Taraji P. Henson got him confused with Jordan Howlett, which was a hot mess, it really was. Now, I did not understand why he would throw the rose on the ground. So he made a video explaining the reason why he threw the rose on the ground. He said that it wasn't his moment, it was given to him, but it wasn't his. Last night was the BT Awards, and right now, it's something on my mind. Let's talk about it. First and foremost, I want to start by saying I am not upset at Taraji P. Henson by any stretch of the imagination. And not only that, in my opinion, she smoked it last night. I don't think for one second Taraji had any ill will or any ill intentions behind the situation. The situation happened the way it did. It is what it is. I made a video last night where I had the rose that was given to me in my hand and I let it fall on the floor. The reason I did this had nothing to do with Taraji P. Henson. The reason I dropped it on the floor is that I wholeheartedly believe that wasn't my rose. That wasn't my rose. That wasn't my moment. It was given to me. But it wasn't mine. And I always say, I don't want nothing that ain't mine. I want was meant for me. Nothing less, nothing more. The entire segment on the production side felt extremely rushed. Not only did it feel rushed, it did not feel intentional. It did not feel purposeful. I'm forever thankful for every room that I'm in. I was more than thankful and more than grateful to just sit there and enjoy the show. Me and my wife, we looked amazing. We felt amazing. We was enjoying the show. I've always spoke about my social anxiety. And for me, just to get out and be in that moment was more than enough for me. So to take me and my wife out of our seats... Put us in different seats. Give Taraji no direction to who we are or what we do. Felt extremely unprepared and unprofessional to me. I'm personally a fan of Taraji. I've been for years and I always will be. I love to see her get the recognition that she deserved in that moment. And had a platform and a stage that she's always deserved. For this situation to take away from her moment and our moment was unfair to both of us. And another example of this is a picture of my wife has been going around and it was a small part caught from an entire moment to make it seem like she had an attitude with Taraji. My wife and myself understand the flirting that Taraji was doing was fully improv and fully joke. It was a hard situation for all of us to be in. We fully understand she made it up on the fly. I was there to just enjoy the show. I was invited. No situations in life in general. I never longed for the spotlight. If I wanted the spotlight, I would have accepted a quarter of the opportunities that's been presented to us. But none of those opportunities were for me or my family. If you understand that, you understand it. If you don't, I'm okay with that. I'm always gonna be myself. I've always been myself. Nothing about this journey, about this ride, about where we at or where we gonna be is gonna change me. Never have and never will. Never once was I upset that Taraji didn't know who I was. Everything that's for me will be for me. Everything that's for my family will be for my family. Everything that's for you will be for you. When it's supposed to be, how it's supposed to be, with no confusion. I said that last night, and that was still misconstrued, and I stand on it a thousand percent. Whatever room I'm supposed to be in, whoever's supposed to know me, whenever they're supposed to know me, it will happen how it's supposed to happen. Last night, while I appreciate the opportunity, it wasn't my moment, and that's okay. I'm cool with that, and for every single person that's been on this journey with me and that's still on this journey with me, I'm forever grateful. I appreciate y'all. I can't say it enough. God bless you. Have an amazing day. Y'all be safe. We all humans. We all make mistakes. It is what it is. I just wish they would have set both of us up for most success in that situation. That's it. God bless you. Okay, so y'all saw that video. Now, I do agree with him when he said that when they switch their seats, they should have given Taraji some kind of direction on who they were, which I actually said that in my last video. They should have let her know who exactly Keith Lee was because she did not know. And it was an actual honest mistake on her part. But like Keith Lee said, BT should have done better with actually letting her know who these people were. As far as him dropping the rose on the ground, that was a little bit too much. He could have just not posted that or whatever. I understand that he has his ways of doing things or whatever, but that could have just been like eliminated he should not have posted that because he got a lot of backlash and this is why he made this video of him saying that he wasn't upset with Taraji but it just wasn't his moment and so he just felt like the rose that was given to him should not have been his but I do think that him posting the video of him dropping the rose was very unnecessary all he had to do was just throw the rose in the trash
and leave it at that, right? And then he addressed the fact that Taraji threw in a little bit of flirting action, which I peeped at too, but she was just trying to play it off because she knew she had made a mistake with getting him mixed up with Jordan Howlett. So she threw in a little flirting just to play it off or whatever. But he did say that his wife, Ronnie, was not upset because people were saying that she had made this funny face after Taraji did that and he said that Ronnie wasn't upset but to me when I looked at it it didn't look like she was like mean mugging Taraji or whatever she was just looking like a little confused like girl who who are you talking about like this is us this is me and my husband Keith Lee that ain't Keith over here that's how she was looking to me in my opinion but what do y'all think about this whole situation with Keith Lee coming out and basically saying that the reason why he dropped the rose was because it wasn't his moment and that the rose wasn't meant for him. Was it unnecessary for him to actually record him throwing the rose on the ground and upload it to social media? And we all know that it was a mistake that Taraji got them mixed up. So what are your thoughts about this whole situation? Y'all know what y'all gotta do? Comment down below. Let me know your thoughts. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Share this video. Like this video. And y'all know what y'all gotta do. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye.